Hello. I was just about to take a snack break with this gigantic cookie. But now that you're here, let's share it. Why don't we split it into halves? Which one of these splits seems fair to you? These choices wouldn't be fair because they are not equal pieces. But this one is, this is one half and one half. Uh-oh, sounds like some more friends are here to share our cookie. But wait, if we share this with more friends, does that mean we'll get more or less? Well, let's look at this. Here are some fraction strips I made. What fraction does this strip represent? This fraction strip is made of three equal pieces. So this is one third. How about this one? This fraction strip is one fifth. It has five equal parts. Now what do you notice about these two fraction strips? Which one has a larger shaded area? The one third is larger than one fifth, even though five is a larger number than three. Why do you think that is? Do you see that? When we cut our hole into more pieces, the pieces get smaller. So one third is larger than one fifth. How about these strips? Can you arrange them in order from largest unit to smallest unit? The largest is one half. Only two pieces means each piece is large. Then one third, one fourth, one fifth, and one sixth. Now let's get back to our snack. What do you think? If we want to have the largest piece, should we invite more friends to share our cookie? Here's how our cookie looks split into halves. And here's what it looks like split into thirds. Which one of these has a larger shaded area? Listen, I love my friends, but when it comes to fractions, less means more. Splitting this cookie into two parts means each piece will be larger than if we shared it with three friends, or four friends, or more. Now I want to write this down. One half is larger than one third. This is a greater than symbol. Remember how the equal sign indicates a relationship between two sides? These sides are equivalent. Well, the greater than symbol also indicates a relationship, but this time it means that this side is greater than this side. So two is greater than one. You can picture this greater than symbol as a hungry alligator. It eats the larger side. The opposite is the less than symbol. Three is less than four. Look, the alligator eats the larger side. Now how about we compare some fractions? If I had a candy bar that was split into thirds and another that was split into fourths, which would the alligator want to eat? Which is greater? We know that with fractions, fewer pieces means larger pieces. So one third is greater than one fourth. Now try a few on your own. Mm. Welcome back. Okay, so I decided to let everyone in. More friends means smaller pieces, but sharing is caring. Great work today.